Hi guys, it's Mary. Welcome back. Today we're gonna do something that I think is kind of clever. Well, my title anyway. <laughs> Head to shoulders instead of something else, right? But seriously, it is from the top of my head and to my shoulders, <laughs> this area right here. The devices that I do use my favorite ones, okay? This mask here is different from the other two. Even the LEDs are different. The LED modules have three chips in each one of the LEDs. It has 66 with three LEDs in each one, totaling 198. Also, in addition to that, there are 20 infrared diodes, 20 of them, okay? Infrared diodes, and with these, the number of usable LEDs then is 218. This one here goes for 20 minutes instead of 10. And I did look into this a little bit because the way my brain works, what 20 minutes says to me is that it's not as strong. It doesn't work as well as the other masks and needs longer time, you know, because the others shut off after 10 minutes. And you know, for the near lights, it might be better to go longer since there's less of them. I don't know. Ask your dermatologist if you really want to know the answer to that. But I did go ahead and ask Adoro, why 20 minutes? And they said, because it's the ultimate amount of time for light therapy to work. And I thought, well, that was short and sweet, <laughs> but I didn't feel like calling the Netherlands to actually speak with them on the phone. So instead I called Omnilux and asked them why 10 minutes. And I was told that that was just the time their devices are set to go off. People are in a hurry, but if you want, you can just press it again and go for 20 minutes. It's perfectly safe. It's perfectly safe. You're going to have to make your own decision about which mask applies the best for your situation and what you want. But I'm going to tell you, cause I know you're going to ask me, this is the mask that I use the most because I am concerned about the whole hyperpigmentation thing. I use this for its green light. This seems like a good spot to throw this info up here. I got this off the Adora website, and since I'm telling you that, I just want to let you know there's a ton of nice information up there on their website. They've done a really good job for those who want to learn. Anyway, <laughs> I know that many of you don't care about this and don't want a huge lesson in light spectrums and what does what in this video. So just skip ahead if you want to bypass all of this, but I'm going to leave it on the screen for a full minute since I know what happens if you try to pause and read something on YouTube. So I'm still using the red light, but I am using this more. I'm using green light on here. And sometimes I will use the other settings. This has 11 different light therapies in it. For me, this is over and above because I don't just get the red and the near infrared. This is a more bendable kind of silicone and hurts my nose, not at all. The others still do. And when I first got this mask, I thought, how cheap are these things, but they're actually the most comfortable. You just put this on. I can even do this over my glasses if I wanted to, which sometimes I do so I can read. And the funny part is this is the one that I was thinking was going to be my least favorite, that it was probably not as good. And it turns out that I like this one the best. If you aren't interested in all the other light spectrums, then possibly the one of the other two is going to work out the best for you. 